Yeehaw! And welcome back to the Southern Snack. Well, life was too short to be serious. All right, folks, let's get into this. Not a big review, but we got new waffle fries at Long John Silver's, and I went to the one of the few A and W restaurants within my vicinity, which is really not within my vicinity. There are no A and W restaurants left in Virginia. Well, there might be one. But I'm pretty sure it's it's in Maryland. Yes, it's in Maryland. You can drive through Virginia to get it, get to it. But there's West Virginia, Maryland, South Carolina, none in North Carolina, none in Virginia. It's sad, but this brand is pretty much dying. I don't even know if people drink the root beer anymore. But if you drink the root beer, let me know. If you eat at A and W, let me know. But this is a Long John Silver's review in a and W packaging, so. We love those combination restaurants. They're the best. Waffle fry time. Let's eat it. They're not as good Chick-fil-A. And they've got that, that crispy outer edge to them, right? And they're not, they're not super hot temperature wise these are the type of fries that these restaurants go and get because they can keep them in the warmer for a while and they don't go bad still very flavorful love this type of fry but it doesn't touch a fresh chick-fil-a waffle fry they are seasoned nicely of course i don't think any of the seasoning comes from inside that restaurant right there but still solid it's everything you want in a french fry that's not fresh right fresh fries of course are different they hit different they're just better but if you're not going to eat a fresh french fry you're going to want a crunchy seasoned flavorful fry and i'll give them credit Eight out of ten. Go get the waffle fries from Long John Silver's. And other than that, I'll see y'all around. Yeah.